The latest Bay Area shelter-in-place order will loosen restrictions surrounding some outdoor activities like construction and landscaping, but keep most social distancing protocols in place. The new rules, which will apply to Alameda, Contra Costa, San Mateo, Santa Clara, San Francisco and Marin counties, will last through May, and largely uphold the current order's restrictions on non-essential business and social distancing mandates, according to sources familiar with the newest order. In a Wednesday morning news conference, Santa Clara County officials confirmed the order's contents and said discussions about future easing are ongoing. It will go into effect starting May 4 and last through May 31. We've already made significant progress on many of these indicators and need to ensure that we don't slip backwards, said County Health Officer Dr. Sarah Cody. Some restrictions, primarily surrounding outdoor activities, will be loosened. All construction will be permitted, with safety protocols that will depend on the size of the project. Golf, tennis, landscaping and gardening will also be allowed. Children will be able to gather in stable groups of 12 or fewer within child care, educational or recreational institutions or programs, including summer camps, that enable essential or outdoor business employees to work. Stable means that the children would not switch groups and that groups would not intermingle, according to the Santa Clara County Order, which mirrors language in other counties. The idea is to allow more employees to go back to work, clarified Santa Clara County spokesperson Evelyn Ho. Groups of children or adults outside the specified settings are still barred from gathering. However, in cases where the state and local orders do not align with one another, the stricter of the two applies, said County Council James Williams. For example, while the new county order allows for golf and other outdoor activities to resume, golf is not included in the state's list of critical workforce sectors. What that means in terms of enforcement in the Bay Area is not yet clear. Other California jurisdictions had already moved to allow golf. Napa County, for example, modified its stay-at-home order to reopen golf courses and allow all construction to resume early last week. Asked about the Bay Area's new shelter rules at his daily press conference Wednesday, Governor Gavin Newsom said state officials are discussing the order's provision allowing gatherings of children, which statewide rules do not allow. Newsom did not indicate whether the state would move to override the local order, though, saying the matter is a point of clarification that we will be advancing. Broadly what they put out today was very consistent with the state guidelines, and they have been incredible partners, Newsom said of Bay Area public health officials. Any future loosening in the Bay Area, meanwhile, will be based off five indicators, according to documents provided to this news organization. The indicators dovetail with the six that Newsom laid out last week and include flat or decreasing coronavirus case numbers, sufficient hospital capacity, at least 200 tests per 100,000 residents per day, stronger contact tracing and isolation, and a 30-day minimum supply of personal protective equipment for health care workers. I wish I could give you a set timeline and tell you when this would end, Cody said. My family asks me, my friends ask me. We don't have a date. County health officers warned earlier this week that despite progress in slowing hospitalization rates and intensive care unit admissions, the Bay Area is not yet out of the woods. South Bay officials echoed that message Wednesday. We are almost there, said President of the Board of Supervisors Cindy Chavez. We are asking for continued patience and continued leadership from all of you. Check back for updates on this developing story.